be honest, an MMA guy now is at the top of the Forbes magazine or whatever for the highest paid athlete. That's pretty, pretty good, huh? Impressive. Yeah, considering everyone, everyone complains about fighter pay. And well, yeah, everyone complains about fighter pay, and everyone complains about him. And this is where I tell people, this, fighters I talk to, don't ever complain about him. Emulate him as far as look at what he's doing, look at what he did. The, you know, the guy stepped out and he created a situation that made pay better for everybody that is in the upper categories. Uh, obviously, that's not going to happen in the mid, mid levels or lower, but it's because of Connor that a lot of guys are making a lot more money. And he did it off of being very braggadocious about things, about making predictions, but he backed those things up. And when he backed those things up, he kept putting more and more pressure on the promotion to pay him more because he was delivering and he got people's attention and he made money and he made the company money. And so he deserves that. And then, you know, all the other things outside of it, business wise, he's made some really good decisions. He's, he's associated himself with very smart people. He has put himself in a position to have businesses that are making a lot of money that he is now some of them that he sold for a lot of money, you know, give it to him, man. You know, he's, he's doing things right as far as making, you know, his brand work and he deserves, he deserves credit for it. He really does. 